shutters can be an awesome piece of the architectural pie, but they're often misused or poorly installed. So I wanted to show you some tips and tricks for working with fake vinyl shutters and how to get the most from yours. <laughs> Today it's fun with vinyl shutters. You definitely don't want to miss this super helpful video. All right. Hey, we are in the car. We are heading to go get some... What are we getting, Charlie? Nothing. <laughs> Nothing? What are we going to get at the store, man? <laughs> okay, so he's not going to help me as much, but we're going to get some awesome shutters. And I'm going to show you guys exactly how cool shutters can be and how to the proper use of some shutters. Right, Charlie? No. <laughs> so glad I have you to help, man. All right, you read your book. I'll start driving. And Daddy, and we'll see you guys in a bit. Bye. On a desert highway, cool wind in my hair. with that. Sorry. Okay. All right, I am here in the quote unquote shutter section of Lowe's, which is that. And we've got a few more down there. So I'm gonna check out what some of the options are they have here. We've got some of these nice plastic, wrapped in plastic shutters with the nice louvers. They've got some down here that are, ooh, look, raised panel, low raised panel. You can get really exotic with these. So the options apparently here are black, black, and black, but I can see that they obviously have some other colors I could choose if I want. And I've got about four sizes to pick from, so. I'll pick out some really nice winners and take them home and I'll show you how we can use these properly. Help me pick out some winners. This one. Those are the ones we should get? Mm -hmm. Alright, you want to pull them out? Mm -hmm. That's what we're getting. Good stuff. So, I've got my fake vinyl shutters back here at the shop ready to get them prepped for installation. Um, we have picked the 15 by 51 uh, black shutters since black was the only option they had. So let's get these unwrapped and uh, see what we're looking at. Some screws, looks like three inch screws, and some washers. What you want to do first, throw those in the trash. These black ones, you can throw that in the trash too. You won't be needing any of that. In all actuality, there is a proper way to deal with these, proper way to install them, and I'm going to show you that right now. So we're going to set this one aside. We'll start with the first one here. Oh, it's there. I'm going to show you. My, my uh, main tool for shutter installation when it comes to these fake vinyl ones is the circular saw. Now you have to know how to use this properly. We're going to put some eye protection on, and I'm going to show you the right way to prep these shutters so you can trim them to fit just right. Here you go. Gather all your pieces up. And once you've got these trimmed into nice two to three inch sections, you're going to gather them all up and get ready for installation. Now, there's only one place these need to be installed, and it's right in here. And that's it for shutter installation. So, hope you've enjoyed this. Uh, next time, buy real shutters. And don't waste your money on things like this. Thanks for stopping in today for some fun with vinyl shutters. If you want some real help DIYing your old house, check out my other videos. And don't forget to visit thecraftsmanblog.com for hundreds of tutorials geared toward historic homeowners. Till next time.